Hey, good afternoon, CRST drivers and independent contractors. Perry Moser here. It is Wednesday, April 22nd, and just bringing you your daily update. So let's start with our safety topic for the day. Bet you can't guess what it is. That's right, fatigue. We're going to talk about fatigue again today. We've been talking about it all week. Uh, good reminder that I got a few weeks back, I uh, forget who sent it to me, but an awesome driver, was about doing a personal pre-trip. Talking about making sure you know you spend that 15, 20 minutes on a pre trip for your truck, but you're not getting yourself ready for a, really an 11 hour uh, shift. It could be even be longer, up to 14 hours. Making sure you slept, making sure you have your hydrated, making sure that you know where you're going to stop, making sure you kind of have an idea of hey, you know, today I'm just not feeling it. Today I'm feeling like eight hours. I can't do the full 11. Understanding where you're at personally before you start that truck up. So, another great reminder to really the battle fatigue is that personal pre-trip. I love that concept of a personal pre-trip. Second thing I have along the lines of safety is it appears that our friends at the California Highway Patrol are back out and uh, inspecting trucks, seeing some violations coming in from the state of California. So obviously they've kind of taken a back seat during this whole COVID uh, pandemic, but it looks like California's back out. So that's just a heads up. I'm sure our friends in the great state of New Mexico are not too far behind. I'm sure they're missing the revenue. So be careful out there, making sure you're doing your proper pre-trips, post-trips, making sure you have all your documents ready to go and making sure you have your logs. That spare set of, of paper logs that you may need, that's an easy one for them to get you for. If you don't have a spare set of paper logs, stop and get some. Stop and get some or they'll write you up for those too. Um, I also have anniversaries today. I have one. I have Ramon from Denver, Colorado is celebrating one year with us today. And the last thing but not least thing is facecoveringcontest.com. Again, I have plenty more gift cards to give away. Please send me some cool pictures at fccontest.com. Um, last thing, uh, real quick. It looks like the supplies, the 55-gallon uh, drums of hand sanitizer, and a ton of masks are hitting the facilities now. So if you're going to any one of the facilities, it can be a garden facility, it can be an expedite facility, um, it can be anybody's facility. Stop in, stop in the shop, um, make sure you grab a mask um, and uh, some hand sanitizer as well too. If that specific shop doesn't have it yet, I apologize. It's kind of in motion right now, but obviously in the major shops, Cedar Rapids, Riverside, all those are all supplied as well. So stop by the shop, check it out. Have a great, safe rest of your day. Fatigue.